years ago, you started an open source project named after a child's toy. Uh, that open source project has become fairly central to the next you know, big thing in the computer industry. And you're now part of a large and very successful company based on your open source software. What does this say about open source and how it's changed over the years? I mean, I think open source has come to be uh, the expected uh, platform uh, for um, new technologies. I think uh, people have learned uh, that if they're um, uh, given a choice between an open source platform and a proprietary platform, uh, the, the open source one is one that's going to work better for them in the long term. Uh, that they, um, their business won't be at the mercy of someone else's business. Um, uh, they, can, they can consume that software as long as they want and use it however they want. Um, as their business grows, as the use of the software grows, um, without having to uh, renegotiate contracts um, uh, about their, their core technology. So how does it feel, though, for, for basically for this to have been pulled into the world of uh, big companies? You know, I, I think back to when I was on the board of MySQL, and uh, then they're about to go public, and instead they got acquired by Sun, and then Sun got acquired by Oracle, uh, I'm sure at least in part because they wanted to get their hands on MySQL. And I'm not sure that that was the best thing for MySQL in the long run. Is that a risk for Cloudera and what you've built? I don't think so. Um, I think we're protected by a couple of things in this case that, that MySQL wasn't. Um, the Apache license um, actually uh, helps us a lot. Um, in that um, it's easy for folks to fork. And the Apache Software Foundation, as an independent foundation, um, uh, also helps us a lot. I mean, uh, MySQL used to have a, a dual licensing model um, uh, where in order to make, uh, you know, to build their revenue model, um, uh, and where they gave it to most people under the GPL, but if you wanted to use it under other terms, you had to, to pay them. Um, and we don't rely on that um, uh, for our revenue model at Cloudera. Um, and consequently, um, uh, people can fork it um, easily um, uh, if they need to. And so there isn't the possibility for a company to take it and really control it uh, and take it away from people. Um, and Ap Apache is an incredibly strong institution um, that we've all come to, to trust um, uh, to manage software communities. Uh, so I think, I think the combination of the Apache license uh, and the, the software foundation behind it um, uh, get, can give us confidence that no, no corporate concern is going to take over uh, the technology. 